Our next story takes us to a restaurant in Old Town Alexandria. The manager says a food delivery driver came in to pick up an order and then he took off with a jar full of tips for the restaurant's workers. Our Katie Lusso is in the newsroom with some exclusive surveillance video. Katie. Yeah, and Leslie, let's show you what happened here. This person who you see right here told the worker behind the counter that they were there to pick up a DoorDash order. We'll watch closely. They're over here right now. The worker walks away and they decide to help themselves to the tip jar. But this wasn't just a few dollars. This was a week's worth of tips. In the heart of Old Town West along St. Asaph Street sits this family owned restaurant Sunday in Saigon. But on this particular Sunday, the 13th, their cameras captured someone who hurt their heart and stole from their tip jar. I was wondering what's, what's going through your mind. What are you thinking? It's a tip. You have to know it's a tip. You have to know there's some money these guys earned. Why would you take it from him? Randy Phillips is the manager, his wife, the owner. He says the person came in around 7 p.m. on the 13th and said he was there to pick up a DoorDash delivery order. He gave us the, the name and it wasn't ready. The clerk up front went to the back to see what was going on, what the order was ready or not. And I guess that's when he decided to uh, help himself to the tip jar. Their surveillance cameras show him dip his hand in once, twice, and then a third time, emptying the jar and dashing out the door. The thing is, the crew only empties that jar once a week on Sundays, so it had a full week's worth of tips. They estimate it was about 200 bucks. Tonight, asking how a person who does DoorDash deliveries would have the audacity to steal tips. Money they earned and people tipped them for, the ser for their service. So, yeah, it's, it's, uh, it was a punch in the gut to them. How would he feel if somebody took his tip at DoorDash, you know? I'm sure he lives on tips, too. As for why the tip jar was left out, well, they never thought someone would stoop so low. He leaves it out to, you know, kind of promote tips. You want, you know, people see tips are more likely to put tips in the tip jar. You, I mean, don't think about that kind of thing. Is that going to happen? No. You know, they, that's why they left the money out. They've been, we've been here several years now, never had an incident. Now, a few things I want to mention. The owner told me she offered to compensate her employees for the stolen tips, but told me tonight they wouldn't accept it from her. However, I do have some good news. I just heard back from DoorDash in the last hour and a half, and they said the Dasher responsible has been deactivated, and they're also going to provide a courtesy payment to the restaurant to make up for those stolen tips. Leslie? Yeah, those stolen tips are coming back, but the stolen trust, that's a lot harder to get back.